This video is brought to you by Bella Canvas. The innovators behind Black Heather and Fast Fashion just launched their very own YouTube channel. Starting a t-shirt business and want to know more about pricing your tees? Well, stay tuned. I have some tips coming up right now. What's up guys, Gary Ejene, T-Shirt Help Desk. And uh, recently I was doing a live show and people were asking questions and someone asked about uh, pricing of their tees. And I was like, you know what? That would be a really good video. Um, it's involved, but I'm gonna try to put as much information as I possibly can in this video on pricing tees. So let's get right into it. Okay guys, the basis of your t-shirt business is going to be your t-shirt blank, all right? And over here, we believe in the best for best principle, meaning what's the best quality that I can get for the best price? Now, of course, we recommend Bella Canvas, okay? In particular, the unisex jersey short sleeve T from Bella Canvas style 3001. All right, it's a great t-shirt, great fit, feels great, and it is a great price. That price being $2.99. Now, you're gonna start with that. That's your base. The next thing is gonna be your print. I mean, this is a t-shirt business, so you have to have a print. Now, there are several ways to print your t-shirts. There's, of course, screen printing, all right? There's custom heat transfers. There's vinyl cutting. And of course, there's DTG, or whatever else you can think of, all right? For every method of printing, there's going to be a price. If your screen printer charges you a certain amount per shirt, that's your price. If you're doing a vinyl cutter, you have to factor in what's the cost of the vinyl, okay? Um, if you're using a DTG, what's the ink cost, all right? There's usually, on a lot of DTG, it actually tells you how much um, the ink uh, charges are, all right? Um, so you have to factor this in. So just for just averaging it out, let's just say that we're gonna go with $2.25 per shirt. So now you have your shirt costs, which is $2.99. We're just gonna round that off to $3. And you have your printing costs, which is about $2.25. Please understand, guys, these prices are not written in stone. Your cost for printing may be a dollar. Your cost for printing may be $4. You may be printing the back, the front, and the sleeves, you know what I'm saying? Or you may have a little tiny left chest. I don't know, these prices are random, okay? I'm just putting some average pricing to give you an idea on how to price your t-shirt. Another thing to factor in is any accessories that you're gonna have on your t-shirt, meaning um, the back neck print, you know, is that gonna be done or are you gonna have that done? That could be an additional charge. Um, any sleeve or hem tags, that's a really great look, okay? You're gonna have to factor that in, the actual price um, for the actual labels and having the labor to put that in, you know what I mean? You have to factor all of that in. Also, if you're gonna get hang tags, okay, that's a price, okay? So you're gonna have to factor all of this in and add this to the actual price of the manufacturing of your T-shirt. So just to put this on to add to your price, you may use it, you may not. You wanna add in the cost of a hang tag and a bottom hem and a back neck transfer, okay? I say that all that will probably cost you another $2 and let's just say 50 cent. Okay guys, so you have $3 for your T-shirt estimated. 225 for your print estimated and another 250 for your accessories to go on your shirt bringing you to a grand total of seven dollars and 75 cent for your actual cost 
of your shirt. All right, guys, stop, stop, stop. If you're liking what you're hearing, I want you to do me a favor. I want you to go, see, it's gonna be up here, down in the description box, somewhere on the page, all right? I want you to go to subscribe to T-Shirt Help Desk. And when you hit that subscribe button, make sure you click on that notification bell so you can be notified of all of this hotness we got for you to help you on your T-Shirt journey, all right? Anyway, back to the video. All right, guys, so that's your cost, okay? That's your cost. Once again, these are random numbers, okay? You know, once you actually do your cost analysis, you're gonna see what it costs you, okay? This is just for educational purposes only, all right? So once you have your cost, now you can begin to add on your profit in the form of coming up with your sales or your retail price. If your shirt is $7.75 and you're selling it for $10, that's gonna give you a profit margin of $2.25. If you charge $15, your profit margin is going to be $7.25. If you charge $19.99, your profit is going to be $12.24. Okay, sound a little bit better. Now, if you can sell your t-shirts at $24.99, to me that is the sweet spot of t-shirt pricing. You're getting a profit margin of $17.24. That is a really great profit, okay? $17.24 is awesome. That's the sweet spot. That's what I recommend. If you can, you know what I'm saying, if your t-shirts lend itself to that price point, I suggest that, okay? Now, if you're using one of those low quality t-shirts, you know, one of those cheap tees that you guys, they sell for like a dollar, dollar fifty, sometimes even two bucks, you might not be able to get that $24.99. That's why I have the best for best principle. And that's why I'm suggesting Bella Canvas because you're not just getting a great price, you're getting great quality. So think about that first. If you're gonna go for that sweet spot, get a quality blank. Otherwise, people do not want to pay $24.99 for a shirt that feels like cardboard. Now, the next thing is going to be uh, $30 and up. That is your premium, your premium t-shirts, okay? Now, that, if you sell them at 30, your profit is going to be $22.25. That is a great profit. The only thing is that sometimes it gets kind of funny and some people don't want to pay 30 bucks and up for your t-shirt, especially if you're a new company and no one's ever heard of you. But one of the ways that you can really get them is your choice of blank. Now, I told you before about uh, Bella Canvas, the Style 3001, which is a fantastic t-shirt blank, which can also be sold at premium. But if you really want to kick it up a notch and get into that premium, t-shirt business you can use the bella canvas 3001 but what i suggest is the bella canvas the unisex tri-blend short sleeve t style 3413 i mean this thing is phenomenal i mean it feels like butter it really feels like a high quality premium t-shirt because it is, all right? Now the pricing is a little bit more expensive at $4.79 a tee. Okay, now also please note that if you order the premium tees or any of these tees through your printer, it may be slightly more because they have to adjust for their shipping, uh, stocking fees, and all this stuff. So it may be slightly more, but that's totally normal, okay? You can get it through your printer, or you can go directly to Bella Canvas. It's totally up to you, all right? It's, it's whatever one is more convenient. But if you're doing premium, and you're going, and then you're asking for $30, $35, 40 60 bucks in some cases, then you cannot do any better. If you're doing premium tees, get this style. I mean, it's really going to take your business to a whole nother level. All right. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to give you this um, to give you a cursory, just a cursory understanding of what goes into pricing your T-shirts. I strongly suggest that you do your due diligence and do a pricing analysis that is going to reflect your 
company and what you're going to do. All right. Please don't come to me talking about, yeah, but electricity costs this and, you know, uh, my rent costs this and this. Though I'm not talking about all that stuff. I'm not talking about every bit of overhead. This is just a basic understanding. All right. So anyway, guys, make sure that you go up and you click and you go to that Bella Canvas YouTube channel. If you like this, you are going to love them, okay? They have everything that you're gonna need from pricing tees, uh, information on DTG, sublimation, celebrity interviews. It's crazy what they have going on over there. So make sure you go up and down in the description box and subscribe to their YouTube channel and go to bellacanvas.com, okay? So anyway, guys, that is it. Remember, do something good for somebody. And if you don't have anyone to do something good for, do something good for yourself, all right? Remember, as always, cheers to your t-shirts. I'm finna put some butt on my shoes and slide on out the door. Until next time, peace. Let's replace it with justice, all right? Later. Now, I believe in a best for best principle, meaning the best quality 